what is going on everyone and welcome back to more final fantasy so i wanted to do this video because 6.4 came out earlier this week and i know i don't do a lot of videos of final fantasy on the channel but i do play it pretty regularly and it's a little bit of a break from you know the average grind in bdo so i like doing the traditional mmo stuff like dungeons trials raids and everything so yeah i wanted to do all four of these raids i guess we'll do them uh together and i'll be doing it on a healer so for all of you who have never seen it uh, i'll try to do some educational explanations of how to go about doing everything i have done them before and i think they're really fun just this whole entire patch was really good so yeah hopefully you guys are going to enjoy it enjoy it i'll probably put all four videos in one assuming it doesn't take too long but yeah it should be cool so I've actually done this on all three roles, DPS, tank, and healer, but I like doing healer. It's just more or less I get to control what's happening. And if generally, if you know what you're doing, you should probably play healer or support. So these are the new four raids that came out, the ninth to 12th circle and the tier. And I personally enjoy the music on all of them. But 11 is probably my favorite, followed by 12, and then 9 and 10 have the same one. So I'll let you guys listen to that as well as me explaining the mechanics and what to look out for, just in case you have not done it yet. The story is pretty good. Beat that too. But I think my favorite thing to do in this game is probably the alliance raids, but that's coming out later in the patch. So soon. But yeah, you'll probably see an edit if the queue takes too long, and I'll just keep uh, waiting for the queue, and then you'll see an edit. So we'll do all four of the new raids. All right, we're starting the ninth circle. That one's pretty fun. First one of this tier. All right, let's see. How many new people do we have? One new tank, I believe. Overall, this one isn't too bad. I think all the mechanics are pretty straightforward. Um, if you are new to Final Fantasy and wondering how do like you learn raids, just look at the arena, and generally it tells you everything you need to know. So what do we have? Two melee, two ranged. Oh wait, we got two new people. The healer's new, and then the other tank. Two gunbreakers, scholar. Not bad. All right, I'll try to explain the mechanics as they happen. There's not much for the first like 30 seconds, so. Keep DPS in it until we get mechanics. I believe the first thing we're gonna get is a fire. Yeah, fire three. So whoever gets the markers move away from other people because these things expand. And so you wanna be out of that. Next thing we're getting is Blizzard 3. If you watch the cast over here, so it's gonna start from the outer ring and then it closes in on the circle. So you wanna just be in the middle. You 
So it is a combination of various things. Oh. Be inside. music is really good though so definitely recommend listening to it plus i need to farm the orchestration rolls those are dumb expensive if you're wondering like what i look at on the screen like uh debuff bar uh cast bar and cooldowns Stand in Queen it. If you get the middle one, it's a safer spot, but it's a little, a little bit further in the back. He's going two healers. If you knew how many times I've seen people stack the stack markers and then it's just party wipes, it's pretty funny, actually. Yeah, don't do that. Gonna do frontal. Does that at least one more time, and I just have to make sure to watch the cast bar for that. Gonna do knockback. God, I hope this tank moves. <laughs> Your tank, you get those, just move away from the boss. Everyone else is gonna be a bomb in the center. We just hug the edge. Find the side that doesn't have a bomb marker. Follow that. Three rocks are gonna drop. Find the one that's not cracked. that um let's see what's happening next do i have time for another raid Got time, raise the tank and the healer. We should be good. Need to get MP back. Stand in the center, it'll pick a color, stand behind that one. So it picked red, we stand behind blue. It'll expand and blow up. One more time. Opposite colors. Six percent easy. Do you think the last 
<laughs> no one's dead. That's good. Overall, that wasn't too bad. It's a lot of just uh, maneuvering around. Don't get hit. And the hardest thing about these raids is the other people. If you're a good player and you know it, just <laughs> hoping the other people don't get you. Pass all button when? I'm just here for like showing you guys the raids and if an orchestration roll drops, I want that. All right, next. Three more. And 11 and 12. I do wonder if there's a faster queue if I do play tank. You know what? Let's try it. Guess we're playing tank. This one is a little bit tricky, but it's not difficult. Imagine being a healer and missing your Q. It's usually instant. You know how in Final Fantasy there's a, like, when you log in, there's always a queue to get in? If you miss your queue, it should just kick you offline. And then you have to just log in again when you're not AFK. That would literally fix the queue problem. Someone's doing 11. the music here let's see we got three new people one of the tanks is new one of the healers first time and a dps Let's see. So this one, this fight is a lot of looking at colors and it's gonna be like orange and purple. It's knowing what happens when both of them. And so if you look at the arena, you see how like every corner Yes, we're main tanking. So it's purple, you see the thing? It's gonna do a cone down the middle and then on the sides. Now it's light gonna do the opposite down the middle and then inner purple again so it's gonna go hard to center and then outers
Number one rule of MMOs is don't stand in front of the boss unless you're the tank. So there's gonna be two circle colors. You're gonna look at what color you have and then be in the opposite one. So I have purple. I'm gonna go in yellow. If you don't, you're just gonna keep taking a large dot. Will you be judged worthy to exist? These magics are not for you to win. Knock back again into yellow. So what you're gonna want to do is be on the outer edge and don't run in again. And clusters. Colors again. I don't know if it's random because I've always seen it like I've always gotten the same one every time dark so I'm I got a dark circle that means you're going light it's purple that means we have to go in after so we're gonna get knocked back and then go in uh immunity from that knock back Dark circle. It's gonna jump on the other tank and then we run in. stack it's a good time to get in damage I am the emissary and I colors again light this time. Light, you want to stay, you have to stay in the circle. We'll move farther back. Knock back in purple. Thirty-three percent to go. Overall, not bad. Everyone seems to know what they're doing. Light move out and far back. For victory. So he's gonna do a cross. <laughs> oh my god. These magics are 
It was the other way. Way further back. Oh no. Warriors forged in my own image. Uh let's see, lays on this side. So it's gonna expand. All right, so this is more or less where we were at before. These are not for you. Yellow, get in and then don't move forward. Multi. Light. Ooh, that healer almost died. All right, that was cool. That was 11 down. Orchestration roll? No orchestration roll. That was kind of fun. That's 11. All right, 12th circle, let's do it. This one actually has a very good uh, soundtrack or orchestration role. That's why it's like three mil now. I guess I can main tank this one as well. No big deal. If you've ever done a lot of the Eden raids, these are kind of the same, or this one is kind of the same. Let's see, we got four new people. Five gear. Honestly, this guy's cracked. You should be main tanking, but I guess I'll do it. It is kind of important to keep this lined up. So the mechanics for this fight are watching her wing colors, or she'll do circles around it, and then following donuts. <laughs> so left side, right side, right. So it's gonna blow up left side first and then double others and move. So if you get the laser on you, the 
It's gonna do beams down to center and to two people at targets. Oh god. So green first, pink, and then crisscrossing it. Boss won't turn. So this is the super chain cast. You find the donut and then stand in the donut. You see the donut? Follow it over here where it connects to. It'll do, do bombs that'll do explosions everywhere. And then this is a safe zone in the circle. Another chain, but this time is going to have mechanics. <laughs> so we want to go follow the short donut first, and then the big donut. When she says that, shine brilliant, that means he's gonna do like front and back of where she's standing. Floors are gonna pop wherever the chains are. Don't be in those. Two yellows and two reds. Watch out where they're going. Might have just beamed some people. It's important to hold it like straight down this line because it's easier for people to see. So after this phase, we're getting ads. And this one is a little bit tricky because people, if they don't know like how to react fast, it might wipe the group. So I have to... People need to move out of that. It's gonna hit everybody. And then once you kill all the ads here, you want to get out of the middle lanes. Can't do that. <laughs> I do my best to try to line up this middle line, so that means it's when it does mechanics, it stays that way. Um, okay, so follow the donut. You see it over there, it's going there. But at the same time, it's gonna do that line from her. So yeah, it's gonna do a straight line diagonal move out of that. And then go into the donut. 
Floor is gonna break, and we gotta find which one does which. So there's no donut in here. That means you gotta find a safe zone. I just tried to make sure to turn it for that one samurai <laughs> so he can hit his positionals. Green, pink, red, in that order. Floors are breaking, beams going out. Oh my god. I would need her to go back to the center. Positions are messed up. Oh god, she about to break the ground again. Really? 7% just kill it. Do more damage. Don't die. 
do ma do more damage. Easy. Orchestration roll. Ooh. It's a 39. We're not getting it. Feels bad. It would be a miracle if I won that orchestration roll, but I don't think that 39 is winning anything. Eventually, like, give it like a month and then it's not going to be worth much. But for now. Oh, someone else got it. One more to go. Let's do it. Oh, that was instant. Dude, tanks are like short demand today. Okay, let's see. Two new players. This one is actually probably the trickiest of all of them, in my opinion. Because it requires everyone to be more or less coordinated. And knowing, you know, left and right. This is like one of the cooler ones in my opinion, but it's a little bit tricky. Tether on people, so you want to have like, along with the little like Dorito looking thingies, you want to have it spread out. And then you could tell when to stand in it and when not to by like the thing that appears from the top of it. I mustn't Lady so this one I believe you can stand in it. If you get hit by it, I'm pretty sure you just get a doom stack. This might be black webs. So watch out for the bridges. You can cross those. Oh, 
face the other way or be on the other side of the face. Um, one of those don't get hit. Stand on the exit side or like the place where it goes last and stand, rotate. Watch the bridges. So this one hits the entire center. You gotta cross. Don't run through the poison, obviously, but cross. get a Volan stack if not everyone stands in one. Well, like, as long as they're filled, it's fine. Oh, you could have stood in- I could have stood in that. It's fine. This is a big heal check. gonna do a purple knock back after so you want to really like stand at the edge it knocks you pretty far Oh my god, this DPS.
I should probably pop all of those out of two bone. Kill it. Bird. Big DPS. Let's go. Dang. No orchestration rule. All right. Well, those are the four raids. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching.